Yeah. Ooh. Best show here. Another Tuesday night. It's time for the greatest single broadcast that you've never heard about. Right? Sure, we're not serial or Welcome to Nightshade or whatever that thing's called. What is that thing about like a town in Vermont or something? I don't even know what people love it. I'm sure it's what is it like uh is that like an updated version of what's his face? Ga- Garrison Keeler. Welcome to Nightshade. With- Are they just like weird things that are happening in Nightshade? What town is that take place? What town does Nightshade uh, take place in? That's what I want to know. What town? What is it? Uh, Strange things are happening in Nightshade, Pennsylvania. I think it sounds like it's uh, uh, the what's his face, the the one uh, fraud who has built the government out of uh, millions of our dollars, Garrison Keillor. Basically, no different than he is the he's the broadcast version of the four hundred dollar toilet seat that the military buys. Uh, Garrison Keillor, where charges uh, America overcharges, bills them. That's what he's done, Garrison Keillor, with his uh, uh, Lake Wobegon, where he the government funds that. the the the, go- the government funds it. Your tax dollars fund that pile of trash. Could you just imagine? That's where our money goes. To, so that this guy can ha- do his, uh... Old man McGillicuddy was in his workshop, uh... Building a, uh... A, 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 a toy sailboat. His number one project was building ships inside bottles. He did not have the same problem getting the ships out of the bottles. And then the audience, Whoa! Oh, 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 that means he dropped the bottle! Whoa! Oh, oh. He uh, did not have the same problem getting the ship out of the bottle. Whoa! Oh, 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 oh. That guy. It's like a it should be a villain in Die Hard Six, Garrison Keillor. You think you can escape me, John McClane? Um, I've taken everybody in this building hostage. Sure, I'll walk across this glass in bare feet. So, yes, yeah, so I don't even know what Welcome to Nightshade is. It's not like Evening Shade, is it? Remember that show? With Burt Reynolds? Is Nightshade, Welcome to Nightshade, anything to do with Evening Shade? Welcome to Nightshade. Things are spooky tonight. In Nightshade, Pennsylvania. Beware, it is all Hallow's Eve. And on a night like tonight, ghouls and goblins rise from the grave and do their mischief on the people of Nightshade, Pennsylvania. Is that what it is? I truly don't know. I'm assuming that's what that show... Look, maybe it's the best show that's ever happened, and this show, uh, I should be in jail for calling it the best show, like uh, the, the way Google should be in jail for stealing my stuff. Maybe. Maybe it's the best thing I ever heard. Nightshade. I gotta listen to that. Mike's pre-screen six episodes of this thing. Welcome to Nightshade. And give me the, uh, give me the lowdown. Who knows? I don't know. Might be great. I'm not even making fun of it. I truly don't even know what it is. Night. 
Vale. Night Vale. It's not Nightshade. It's Night Vale. How did I get that wrong all this time? That's right. It's not Nightshade. Welcome. Welcome to Night Vale. Fellow ghouls, or does he? Is it? Is it hosted by like a horror host or something? Then is it like a movie? They show a movie on it or something? Like it's just like, welcome tonight. We'll be showing Dawn of the Dead. Look out, citizens of Nightshade. Bub from Day of the Dead is on the loose. The sentient zombie. He's made his way to Nightshade, and he's stumbling through the haunted Arby's, and he's hungry, but not for a big beef and cheese. He's hungry for human flesh. Best show, you're on the air. Uh, hey, Tom, I just got one question for you, my man. Uh, have you... Best show, you're on the air, my man. Guy called me my man. Instant... What do you think, Mike? Dirty Grandpa? You think this is going to stick? You, you, maybe I'm all wrong. What if a year from now I look back and I'm like ranking the De Niro performances and I'm like, all right, top three, number three, Godfather 2, number two, wait, I'll be like, wait, God, is it, is it going to be, is it Raging Bull or Dirty Grandpa? Which is his number one? Which is number one? What if it's good? I don't know. What if dirty... Everybody, welcome to... Welcome to... Nightshade. Here in Nightshade, Pennsylvania. Look out! People on the streets. Dirty Grandpa has come to town. And he's walking around with his new friend, Dudio. They're stealing your cats. Dudio brings the cats back to his master, Dracula, in the castle, high over Nightshade. And Dirty Grandpa, what's he up to? Why, he's going into the haunted Arby's to get the senior citizen's discount on a small coffee. And he's going to read the newspaper for two hours at Arby's, nursing his senior citizen's coffee. At the Haunted Arby's. Look out, people of Nightshade. Dirty Grandpa's on the loose. Best show, you're on the air. Hi, Tom. This is Toronto Sex Dwarf Alex. Oh, my God. 